Okay, first grade, once your foreground is done, we're gonna move our way into the middle ground and our middle ground either has these lollipop trees that Anurvasan uh, really like to use, um, or you have buildings with um, our, our basic square rectangle bottom, but our Hershey top uh, roof. This video is all about the lollipop trees. Those are the easiest. So if you have trees, please do those first. And then after you're done with your trees, you can go ahead and do buildings. Uh, obviously, if you only have buildings, you'll need to watch the building video. As you've been doing the whole time, uh, go ahead and make sure that you are grabbing two of each of the colors that you're going to be using for your trees. Now I'm going to be using yellow and blue. I know that I used yellow before, but my yellow is going to be way higher up than my ground. So reusing a color uh, is, is okay, especially since I'm not going to be using yellow for the background. And I am going to be switching it up. It's not like my ground and my trees are going to be the exact same color. So I'm going to go ahead and just like in our practice, I'm going to start in the center and then I'm going to go ahead and swirl my way out. So I'm going to go ahead and dip, dip, just the tip. I'm gonna spin the brush so it doesn't drip. I'm going to apply a little bit of glue right there over that center circle. brush back in the holder. I'm going to take the end and I'm just going to place it right in the middle of my circle. I'm just going to push and hold one, two, three, four, five. From here I'm going to swirl around like I'm making a snail or a cinnamon roll and when I run out of yarn I'm just going to push and hold. One, two, three, four, five. So for the beginning, no cutting uh, necessary at all. Wherever I stopped, I'm going to grab my next color and I'm going to start working my way around. If you need more glue, Go ahead and start going around the yellow or the color that you chose. I'm going to put the end of my second color where I stopped with yellow. And I'm going to go all the way around until I get back to where I started. So luckily I don't have to cut on this next piece. So I'm just gonna push and hold. One, two, three, four, five. And you're going to just keep alternating. So I did yellow, I did blue, now I'm back to doing yellow. Start where you left off. Work your way around. If your color doesn't make it all the way around, you can go and grab two more. And while I was over there, I grabbed another blue. So I want this color to make its way all the way back to where I started. So your choices are to cut it 
if cutting was too hard, you can just take glue and go over the top of your yellow. And instead of cutting, we can just glue our yellow on to our previous yellow. And this will save you from having to cut any yarn. So if you are having difficulty with cutting, the trick is just to glue the same color on. In order to finish off our trees, this is the only color that we're all going to use the same of. And the bottoms of his trees were just long black trunks. So you only need one piece of black that goes from the ground to the tree. We'll push and hold. One, two, three, four, five. Again, you can either glue the black onto the black, or for those of you that have been getting better with the scissors, you can go ahead and you can cut the extra off. If you have any extra yarn, uh, you can use it for your second tree. If you want your trees to be the same color, or you can do different colors for your tree. If you're using different colors, you can go ahead and move this back so other people can use it. But that is how we're gonna do our Anurvasan lollipop trees. Again, you can rewind this video, you can rewatch the video, you can pause the video, or you can move it forward if you have more trees. If you understand how to do the trees, uh, you no longer have to watch the video and you can just enjoy making as many trees as you have. If you have buildings to make, go ahead and grab that video when you are done. Great job, first grade. We'll see you next time.